Hey everybody, I'm Steve. And I'm Kathy. And welcome to our holiday decor edition of Make It With Mod Podge. Today we've got lots of great ideas and they all have a chic look using black, gold, and pearl paints. It's gonna be beautiful for the holidays. Oh yeah. So let us show you our first project that we did and it's this deer head right here this raw deer head that we bought. We're using pearl white and pure gold folk art metallic paints to paint the deer. We attached a scrapbook bow with the mod melter. Okay, what's next? Next is our Noel wall art. Now this is so cool. You can either lean this against your mantle, you can add a string and hang it. Mm -hmm. But my favorite thing about this project, which almost wasn't, was the four different black and white prints. And I love how that turned yeah, out. Yeah, and I love how the different papers individualize each different letter. Yeah, because originally when I started, I had snowflake paper on all of it, but it just kind of turned to a mush. Yeah. So we found four different prints and we're using my favorite new formula of Mod Podge, the Ultra Matte Chalk. This formula will create the most matte look, which is what we wanted for this project. How'd you do it? Here's how we did it. We started with a blank Noel sign. You can get them at any craft store. I trim my papers to size. I'm using the Ultra Matte Chalk Mod Podge. You just apply it to the back of the paper, position your papers on, you're gonna wait 15 minutes before top coating. One of my favorite projects that we did is this glammed up chic Christmas tree. Yeah, using our mod melts and our mod molds. Now we used our gold sticks, our mod melter and our gem mold. This is like seriously my favorite mold. I know I say that about all you the do, molds, but, but it is. <laughs> Jinx, you know It's a good one. And what's great about this mold is if you were to buy all these kind of yeah. gems in the stores, they'd be so expensive. Kind of pennies. Yeah. yeah. yeah it's so. cool. Love that. Very simple. We started off with our raw tree. To make the gems, we use gold mod melts in the gem mold. I coated each tree branch with a thin layer of collage clay and embedded the gems by pressing. And I added rhinestones for detail. It's the portable Christmas tree. <laughs> portable Christmas gem tree. Love that. One of our favorite things is altering stockings because you can get great stockings that are blank or almost blank at any craft store and most home decorating stores too. Yes. So for this stocking, we added this F for fillion and we attached that just using fabric Mod Podge and then we made a really fun faux fur topper here and we used the same gold Mod Melts and the same Mod Melter yeah. just to attach that. I cut an F from cotton fabric, and then I just simply used fabric Mod Podge to glue it to the stocking. For the topper, I used the Mod Melter to attach gold trim across the bottom. Then I just used Mod Melt to attach the fur to the top of the stocking. Our cardboard boot we transformed into this wonderful gold faux fur I'm trim boot. It Mrs. Claus's chic boot. I think so because <laughs> look, she had to add those little pearls right on top of it. I used my leftover materials to decorate Mrs. Claus's boot.
So many people are decorating with ornaments in a lot of different ways. So we decided to take our clear ornaments here, kind of marbleize them and add this trim around it to give it this kind of industrial bowl filler look. Use three metallic folk art paints. Now turn over onto a plastic cup and rotate the ornament until covered on the inside. Allow to dry. Glue trims in a random pattern. Thank you so much for joining us on our part one of our holiday home decor. Be sure to check out our other two videos that will be coming up. We've got one where we're making a Christmas countdown calendar. That's a mouthful. That's a mouthful. All filled with little treats. Kids are going to love that project. And in our third installment, it is all about candy. We're making a candy house and we're even making candy. Yeah, that's my favorite episode, of course. <laughs> he ate all the candy. <laughs> if you enjoy this video, give us a thumbs up. And be sure to subscribe to this channel and leave us your comments and show us your black and gold and pearl projects. Yes, thanks guys. See you next time. Bye.